And thank you for hanging with us with Rocket Right. I'm Hurricane Betsy Barnes here with Dr. K Solar. And we know what's good for you, don't we? For the holidays, for a little family time. I know what's good for me. Away. What's yeah. good for you? Same thing. <laughs> What's good for me is good food and planning a little getaway or two or three over the holidays. Mm -hmm. Just a little time away. Sometimes a little girl time with the girlfriend. Sometimes some family time. And then maybe just some time to yourself. I got that. I, I know. That. It just seems like we so. don't get very much time to ourselves. Because, you know, busy blondes, it's a lot of maintenance. After oh, yeah. 35, it's all maintenance. <laughs> <laughs> Well, so, I know you've got some cool things to, to share yes. as far as uh, throughout the state, places you can go glamping. And, yeah. you know, I did experience this in Napa. My husband, when we were going out there on uh, on a treat, and uh, he was like, so do you want to check out this glamping stuff? And I'm like, yeah. He thought I would say no, but <laughs> it was so cool. And we did one night, and we were in this luxury cabin with a chandelier and uh up in the trees and it was at a place almost like global wildlife and the animals were around and then they had a wine dinner out there and uh that is cool you know it was extremely cool and now you're telling me we're like going glamping here throughout the state of louisiana we tell me are. more bits because i are. liked it so uh, this past week, Lieutenant Governor Billy Nungesser launched a public-private partnership with a company called Tenter, and it's spelled T-E-N-T-R-R. -R. And Tenter does safari-style canvas tents that have a queen-size memory foam uh, bed mattress. So that's my kind of that's I know. Kind of my camping too, because I'm I'm not for that like on the I'm ground. I'm not sleeping, sleeping on the ground. Thing. You know, I did it when my son was in Cub Scouts, and I was glad we did it and everything. But, you know, I don't think I'm going to do that again. But these glamping sites are an alternative to having to buy or bring a bunch of tent camping stuff. You don't have to have or rent an RV. You can get a cabin if you want to. Of course, our state parks in Louisiana, 21 state parks have luxurious cabins. They have primitive campsites. You can rent an RV spot. It's a great thing, but in eight of the state parks, there's going to be 60 tents set up. Now, these aren't just like regular pop-up tents, although they come with a pop-up up tent if you want to have kids or other people join you but you can sleep two people in this beautiful canvas tent on a wooden platform it has a solar shower a fire pit a grill all you have to do is bring some firewood maybe some wine or whatever other I think it even has a nice little Adirondack chairs it I does it has tables chairs Adirondack chairs a camping loo so you don't have to find the bathhouse in case you have oh, to go going, to the restroom. <laughs> you will. But you know, you just bring your s'mores kits and some of the things that you like to roast over an open fire or on the grill. Um, and Fountain Blue State Park, they have had phenomenal visitation. And so it is the most visitation the state parks have had in 10 years Well, that's years because since you can't COVID. go inside anywhere hardly. So if yeah. you're going to have some fun so, and entertainment getting out, and it's a chance to see some areas of our state where you may not have been before. Yeah, and 90% of the visitors to the state parks right now have been from in-state residents. So people are like, I'm sick looking of my house. Looking for stuff to do. Looking for something to do. So there's plenty of trails. You can rent bikes. Fountain Blue is the one that's probably closest to Baton Rouge, um, closest to New Orleans, and they have the highest visitation. The other uh, campgrounds are located throughout the state. There's seven more. And I got to tell you, the people who run Tenter, go look at the Tenter website, T E N T R R. Dot com. Let me tell you, go on their social media and all. That is a cool company. They're in 42 states. They have a thousand glamping tent hmm. sites, cool. mostly on private property. And Louisiana is one of the first states to use it on state park property, public private partnership. You can even canoe to a couple of the remote sites. You can be out in the woods away from people on water. You can hike, you can be alone, or you can be in an area where there's more than one tent if you wanna have more than one group. Let's say, you know, six of us went. We wanted to do wine and cheese So and they glam. set these up where you want them? Nope, they're set up in specific sites that have been chosen by the owners of Tenter. And these are the best views 
Some are more private, as I said, but there's one at Fountain Blue that I really want to go to that kind of backs up to a protected wetland that is right across from Lake Pontchartrain. And you can see the traffic going across the causeway, but you don't hear it. You canoe to it and you can keep your canoe for the weekend. So Sounds Bayou cool. Adventures, yeah, and they'll guide you I'll to it. I'll go if you'll canoe me. I will. <laughs> I will. So they have somebody in each park that is going to be um, sanitizing all of the campsites and the tents when people leave. They're going to make sure that your beds are done correctly, that everything is just what you need it to be. So you need to go to Louisiana or LA State Parks dot com or you can go to reserveamerica.com and check these things out there's been actually about 25 stories written on this in the last week the um, state parks have had 160,000 people hit their website since friday wow since friday the 13th which was a lucky day if you happen to be there for the roll out because it was really neat and then um in fountain blue and and maybe in some other parks coming up um you can actually have a four-star meal delivered to you by uber eats oh, now if that, you don't want to rough what, it that's what i'm like looking for yeah I, so. I, I only like people to bring me my meals or pick up <laughs> i am not the cooker whether it's in the house the cooker or she clearly doesn't cook if she calls herself the cooker she's not the chef <laughs> i am not the chef i am not the cooker her favorite thing I to make is the, reservations I'm just the saying warmer upper and uh so you're the assembler you That's like right. to like I pick things like up make and then it look assemble. beautiful and take credit for it. Although <laughs> I will admit that for Thanksgiving, I am doing the city pork Thanksgiving pickup. Uh -huh. So, um, yeah, yeah, I, still need I was going to gonna be going to to visit family, and I was getting that for my family that was left here. I might have to add to that because now I'm going to be here too. Because as so many families with increased COVID cases in in other states, they yeah. have decided not to get together. Well, you know, I was, especially for the older folks in the family. Yeah, I was planning know. on making a trip to North Carolina, but with the elderly relatives of. My friends up there, they're just afraid, you know, and um, it's, you know, it's just changing the way we look at entertainment and the way we look at family gatherings and like Mardi Gras, you know, uh, we as I, a state. I saw all that this week. Yeah. So we actually have um, 240 parades and over 100 balls across the state. And so each community is deciding differently what they're gonna do. Of course, Orleans Parish is not having parades. That's canceled. Jefferson Parish is, Mobile, Alabama is. So there'll be, you know, a few different places where you can go. So we're not gonna abandon the joie de vie and the good times, but we're gonna do it a little differently and carefully till we can get a handle on this COVID. 19 that we're so sick of talking I about know. and thinking I, about and protecting ourselves from i gotta say i'll be I'll, you know it's like when you go shopping and you're wearing a mask it's like you want to smile at people but you're just kind of like ah, oh, why bother you i know? know well as i was on a on a zoom call conference today with some of the music industry people throughout the the country and they were saying that you know granted they had moved things to may then they moved things to the fall and then they moved things to january and february and those are still getting canceled now because of yes. where things are at and that certainly their sponsors are not feeling comfortable even coming on board for some of these giant festivals around the country you know till maybe next summer or even fall mm -hmm. and you know unfortunately some of our you know favorite venues festivals around the country some of the big ones are going to like you know hold on and come back some of them may not be there so if there's something happening and your favorite venue is able to do some stuff even even right now if it's outdoors I would say please support them because when things do open up, we want them to be around there. And that's another thing with the support local. Support, support local, local, buy local, buy local and let's shop not, local. We don't want to say bye bye local. We want to like B U Y. That's local. right. We don't want to say I, bye bye local. I, 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 I saw that. So, yeah. So, I'm going to support everyone I can with my shopping and eating out. Mm -hmm. that's and then right. I'm going to go get healthy in the outdoors. As That's right. As, we're going to get some fresh air master. with our catered meal <laughs> that we're going to bring and our corkscrew and bottle of wine. So, yeah. so we look forward to sharing more with you. We want to hear your ideas. Feel free to go to Rocket Right Radio on our Facebook page and tell us what you're doing for Thanksgiving. Yeah. And we're going to be right back. We look forward to sharing a little bit more. Hang tight. We'll be right back.
Since the early 1800s, the Selassie family has played a significant role in the retail industry in Louisiana. Stuart Selassie has achieved the Certified Diamond Graduate designation from the prestigious Gemological Institute of America. What that means to you, whether it's appraisals, design, build, repair, or diamond sales, you have an expert you can count on. At Selassie's, you make all the right choices. Selassie Jewelry and Fine Gifts in the heart of the Denham Springs Antique District. Find them on Facebook. y'all, I'm Amanda Shaw. We all know Louisiana is as fun as all get out. So get out, take a road trip, and explore everything Louisiana has to offer. Fill her up and try a new restaurant that's as fun-loving as it is food-loving. Grab family and take off for monumental adventures at our 21 state parks. Or take a magical minivan tour along our 19 scenic trails and byways and rediscover the character and characters that make our state a lot like nowhere else. Louisiana is a trip. Take one today and enjoy a close by, far from ordinary adventure that's sure to feed your soul. This is Lieutenant Governor Billy Nungesser. Plan your road trip at louisianaisatrip.com. I was diagnosed October 19th. I immediately started with a multitude of scans, and then I was having an eight-hour surgery. My biggest concern was my family and being able to see me come home every day and know everything is going to be okay. I felt comfortable that I was being treated by some of the best. There were some scary points along the way, but um, it's just kind of like been a little blip in the road. Money, wellness, fun. Rocket Ripe Radio takes you all across Louisiana and the nation with guests who live life to the fullest. I'm Hurricane Betsy Barnes. I'm Dr. K. Solar. You're going to love it. Join us every week when we cover everything under the sun. Live and learn with the Wright Sisters. Politics. Health. Music and entertainment. Local Lagnet. Rocket Ripe Radio.